sector. This is gonna be, we're gonna have a fight a lot here, I think. Probably every stop we make. All right, well, let's go. I know there's a distress call here, but I think I'm gonna go up to the store and we're gonna buy some fuel because we're running low. And let's see, we could also, we could sell the laser, but I'm not, I'm not going to. I don't think there's any reason to do that. We're just gonna fill up on fuel and we'll buy one more drone part just because. And then we'll go, uh, I think we could make it to that distress beacon. We might as well try, right? I mean, those have been working out pretty well for us so far this run, so we might as well keep it up. Let's see, what do we got here? You find the source of the distress call, a small research station. Uh, it looks like there was a fire that got out of control. And uh, they're in trouble there. Let's see, we could send in a crew to help them out, which means they might die in there. Doc can try to rescue the survivors, also kind of risky, but we have a rock crew member, Charlie, who is immune to fires, so we can send him in with a uh, minimal risk. Let's see. Your rock soldier tears through the airlock directly into the fire. You've never seen someone that large move that fast, even though his his movement is half of everyone else's. It disperses as much fire suppressant as possible into the heart of the blaze, and eventually the fire starts to die down. Let's talk to the survivors. We got stealth weapons and 45 scrap. Wow. Good deal. Um, yeah, and you know what? We can sell this at the next store we get to because we don't use stealth. Uh, but we should probably move forward. We'll hit a store soon enough, I'm sure. You immediately notice a rebel ship chasing what appears to be a civilian transport. However, you are detecting chatter on the encrypted Federation channel that transport is carrying Federation loyalists. So we could aid the Federation ship or use this chance to escape. Hmm. We, you've been doing so well. I feel like it, we might as well just keep pushing our luck here. Yeah, and it looks like they got a lot of systems. But, so do we. We have a lot of weaponry here. Now, what do I want to use on them? They have two shields, so I'm going to go with the anti-ship drone, uh, naturally. Heavy laser only fires one shot, causes two damage. But I don't know if that's going to break through the shield, so we're going to start off with an ion blast. And, oh, I guess we got to power down some stuff. Let's go with the heavy laser and the ion blast. Because I think that should give us a good chance of breaking through their shields when combined with the anti-ship drone. The whole beam is great, but only if their shields are down, because it, it doesn't go through shields. So, we're not going to use it this time. This is really nice, though. Something I like with our setup, because we have so many weapon systems, we have the ability to be really versatile. Oh, we are on fire, though, which is why we have our rocket guy right there. Oh, but our, drone sh our drones are shut down. So I guess we're just going to continue to pepper them as much as we can. And so far, it looks like we're doing okay. I, I'm just going to keep dropping everything on their shields. And I think we're going to be all right here. We are damaged. We're not, we're not in the greatest of shape. Okay, here. What we're going to do, you two, go fix this. Rockman, put out this fire. Oh, that is really bad, though. We're... Ugh, that is frustrating. There's not a lot we can do here. Let's... I'm going to put some power on the FTL drive for now. All of our, like, all of our offensive systems are completely offline, which is frustrating. Oh, for the love of God. Why? Damn it. This might... I think we might die here, actually. Which is... Uh, it's frustrating because we're doing so well. What missiles are these? That's... It's crazy. Okay, you two get in here. We're going to power up the med bay so we can start getting some health back. Shields should be back online soon. We got a drone powered up. 
everybody's working furiously to get our weapons back online. God damn it. Charlie, go fix this. I don't know what these missiles are using are, but they are crazy powerful and they like automatically start fires, which I hate. Let's power up. Uh, I think our heavy laser, we can't do whole beam yet. So we're just gonna do what we can with what we've got. Okay, good, that missed. Can we, okay, good, good. We're back in uh, some fighting shape here, but we're still not, not quite up to speed, not where I would like us to be anyway. This uh, now, I think we're just gonna be doing our best to hold, this, hold them off while our uh, FTL drive charges. Because once that's done, we're just gonna leave. Ah, damn it. Okay, now our weapons are damaged, but we're not completely out yet. Heavy laser, keep going. Oh, here, we'll put, we'll get our shields back up. I hadn't done that yet. Oh, come on, we're so close to, there we go. We're jumping out of here. Whew. We got out of that, and into another fight. Oh wait, wait, maybe not. Rebel automated ship sits dormant near Rebel forward radar station. With the anti-ship drone, we can distract it. Let's do that. We lost out on a drone part, but we were able to uh, ignore this thing, which is, which is fantastic. Now let's get, we're gonna open up these doors because it looks like some oxygen situations going on here. Let's have you come in here and fix the FTL drive, which I did not realize had been damaged. Charlie can go back in the oxygen room, and then everyone else, I think, is where they need to be, right? Who are you, Mikami? You are... I don't remember if that's where you're supposed to be or not. What's your name? Trelek. You are... yes, you are the shield person, so I think everything's in order here. We are hurting pretty badly for health now. That, I don't know what those missiles were, but they just, they were rough. Let's go to the exit. I'm just sort of, now we're just praying that we find a place where we can heal ourselves. Scanner's showing intelligent life forms on a nearby planet. Oh, we might as well investigate. Oh yeah, the horse-like things. We've, uh, we've come across these before. Let's try to communicate. Um, nothing. Sometimes uh, they'll give us a gift, but not the sakes. Okay, NG Homeworlds, a friendly area. Which is good because we, we're in rough, we're in a rough state right now. Oh, let's see. I don't know, let's come down here. Looks like there's more chance of us finding a store, which we so desperately need. Holy shit. Mantis Bomber, that is enormous, and they have like all the systems in the world. And three weapons, this is scary. Let's attempt to remain concealed. I don't think it's gonna work. Nope, it did not. All right, well, this is gonna be quite the battle, I'm afraid. Again, we're gonna go with the heavy laser and the ion blaster, so we're gonna power down this stuff. Uh, we can, no, we can't have that on. Anti-ship drone should go to work. Ion blast on the shields like we always do, and the whole laser also on shields for now. And then we're gonna have some invaders. Yes, and not in the spot I would have guessed though. Let's send you in there and we'll send the mantis in as well. And uh, we'll just keep firing in here. I'm trying to keep an eye on. Oh wow, Ohm is taking like way too much damage. Let's get you out of there. Can we do anything about the med bay? Let's take down the oxygen for a second to power up the med bay. It should be okay if it's down for just a little bit. And then keep firing on the shields. Can we send, no, I don't want to send you back. Oh, okay, uh, you're getting hurt pretty bad. Let's send in these two. Ion Blast there, Heavy Laser also there. 
We might be able to do this. I'm not terribly optimistic. Okay. You guys are all hurting pretty bad. Let's get you out of there. And then we'll drop this on the weapons. I don't know what's going on with the shields. Okay, that's just the ion blast is keeping them down. We're taking some damage, but I think they are too. I hope so, anyway. Let's, let's fire on their shields again with both of these. Actually, no, we'll fire the laser on the missiles and the ion blast on the shields. We're going to take some damage here. Not a lot we can really do about that. Well, actually... Let's power down the med bay. We're going to put it back in the oxygen because we're hurting there a little bit. And we're going to send everybody back, all these guys, into the shield room. And we'll wait for them there. Let's keep the fire up on this. It's hard to manage both the, the ship fight and the, the crew battles going on here. Okay, keep up this and that. Okay, they left. That is fantastic. Really just dumb luck. Let's get these three set fixing the FTL drive. And then we can now just focus on uh, this situation, which is a huge pain right now. But it looks like we're going to win just barely. We're still really hurt bad. We really need to find a store. But we did manage to survive this. 44 scrap. Wow and three fuel, so we're... I'm not gonna say it was worth it, because it certainly was not, but we are in a lot better shape than we could be. Let's see, Ohm, you can go fight in there. Nikami? What did you do? I think you were in here. Who's this? Oh yeah, you're in there. Yeah, that's fine. There's Trelec he needs to go in the shield room, and we gotta power up our FTL drive. Okay, so we're doing not not great. Oh, thank God, there's a store right here. I think we can come back from this. Uh, fix all for 69, that magic number. And then we'll buy out all of the fuel. And then we'll sell this stealth weapon because we don't use stealth. And we're up to 30 scrap. And I don't think we're going to do anything else here. We could drive. We could buy drone parts, but we don't need them. Let's see if there's anything on our ship we could do. We could upgrade this. More system power for drones, but we only use the one. Could upgrade sensors, which is kind of nice. Hmm. Oxygen. What is that? Just refill boost. A little more. Dodge, if we put this in, we got a 1.5 dodge multiplier, and if we go in here, we have a uh, one-fourth dodge evasion for auto, but that's not... You know, let's buy up one of these. Maybe we'll get... If we get our evasion up a little bit, it'll help us in fights. We could go to this distress beacon. I don't know... Let's, let's do it. It's right next to a store, so we should be okay, I think. Let's see. Small space station orbiting. Satellite defense system has gone haywire. So we've had this one before. We'll just send our NG in again. And we got 51 scrap. One fuel and two missile. That is great. So we're going to come in here, and we're going to upgrade this again. Get our dodge up a little bit. And we have 36 scrap left. We could put that... What should we put that in... Maybe healing? That could be useful. Hmm. Uh, you know what? Actually, I'm going to undo this. We have 66 scrap. It might be worth investing in shields. I'm not sure. Hmm. Or we could try to hold out. And it, once we get 75, we could get more system power. Which would mean we could have... Uh, all of these weapons powered up at the same time, which would really pack one hell of a punch. We need one more power bar to 
do it, I think, to do it effectively anyway. So let's let's buy a power bar for now. And then let's hold out. If we get 34 more scrap, which I think is doable, we'll be in a really good position. This is turning out to be a really long episode, I just realized. Usually we don't last nearly this long. We've had very, very good luck. Uh, nothing here. Great, uh, Distress Beacons. Check it out. Now we're on a crest for scrap. A ship without life forms within nearby dense asteroid fields giving us a distress call. Let's search for the ship. You find the decaying remains of some kind of ship coated with ice or crystal. You send some crew aboard to explore. Nearly everything is either destroyed or un unidentifiable. But one of the weapons appears salvageable, and there's a strange stasis pod that catches your eye. So we could... Okay, it looks like a massive asteroid is in... Oh, okay, so we can only grab one, because an asteroid's coming. We could take the weapon in any spare scrap, or the stasis chamber. This is intriguing to me. I think we could get another crew member. And we're, we got a lot of weapons. Hmm. On the other hand... On the other hand... We could sell that and the scrap and upgrade our our weapons. Give us more options there. I don't know. I know this is uh, interesting. Hmm. Although nobody knows what this ship is. Maybe there's a new alien that we don't know about. I don't know. Let's... God, this is, I, I don't know what to do here. I'm going to go with the stasis chamber. I think, okay, you grab the pod back to your ship. Uh, asteroid shatters everything on the ship. We got damaged stasis pod. All right, so there's nothing inside. Oh, wait a minute, perhaps someone else will know how to open it. It's damaged, but we have it, and we got 21 scrap. So we have a stasis pod, what is... Hmm. This bizarre alien artifact appears to be barely operational. It has no practical function, but perhaps someone can repair it. I wonder who that would be. Not the NG, or else it would have done it. But they're the repair guys. This is... This is strange. I... I have no idea what... I don't know what that is. Hmm. Well, we're at the beacon. Uh, okay, so we could attack an automated ship, or ignore it. Let's avoid provoking. Good, we're fine. I guess we'll go. Oh, but there's another distress call. Hmm, let's go to the distress call. It might be risky. But I, I want to explore this area a bit, because I want to find out what the, what the deal with this pod we found is. You arrive at a smoldering NG research station. Looks like uh, it was attacked. Let's board it. Okay, so we can only save one of these things. The NG, a drone schematic, or ourselves. Let's try to save the NG. Uh, let's see. Oh, one of your crew grabs the NG and throws it into the airlock right before the reactor blows and the automatic blast door slams shut. You have no choice but to mourn their sacrifice and move on. The NG who was saved offers us to cr join our crew. Oh, looks like we lost our pilot. Well, I guess that's not the worst thing in the world. Phillips, you're a good pilot. So, eh, I guess, well, it's not the worst thing. Fish, are you the... Fish is new. Phillips, who are you? He, he hasn't always been our pilot. Oh, may, oh no, never mind. Our human pilot died ages ago. So, yeah, we just traded an NG for an NG. He doesn't have the shield boost that the other guy had, but oh well, not the worst thing in the world. And we're at 90 scrap now, so we can upgrade our weapons like we wanted to. And now, if we power down our FTL, we can power up our whole beam. We still need... One more scrap in order to, uh, which needs 25. 
Okay, well, we'll power down all of this now. Okay, let's let's get out of here. We're lucky that we didn't run into the rebels there. Move on to the next sector, pirate controlled. I think this is the farthest we've ever gotten. We're doing really, really well. All right, let's just get out of here as fast as possible. And actually, us doing this well is um, kind of annoying to me because it's really late when I'm recording this and I'm, I'm tired. Uh, let's see, a ship without life forms. Let's search for the ship. Oh, we got damaged. Oh, we found what appeared to be pieces of a derelict ship coated with ice or crystal. But asteroids got past our shields and we got damaged and we had to pull out. Damn, maybe we could have found out what that pod was. Oh, there's some more distress calls to check these out. We are running low on fuel. I hope we can get some. We arrive at a beacon and immediately detect a pirate ship. Ah, uh, it was a trap. And they're using a Federation bomber. Whoa. They have a lot of weaponry. Okay, so... Let's go with the Ion Blast, Full Beam, Heavy Laser. I don't know about uh, anti-ship. Let's take down the whole beam and put it in the anti-ship for now. If we can get the shields offline, then I'll load up the whole beam. But until then, we'll have to wait and see. So let's target the shields and let the let our drone just sort of go to work. Doing uh, okay, actually, so far. Looks like they have a beam weapon. Ooh, I don't like that. They got through our shields. Oh, that's bad. Um, I think we'll be okay. He should be able to fix that. And he'll be healed at the same time. Oh, I have not been using this heavy laser at all, and I should be. Okay, looks like their shields are offline. We can start targeting their weaponry which we very much need to. Oh, man, we are taking a lot of hits here. I don't like that at all. Oh, damn it, our drones are offline. Everybody go fix that. We need that back. Okay, ion blast on the shields, heavy laser on... Okay, looks like it's trying to escape, which is actually great for us. Oh, great, it looks like their weapons are offline. Ah! That's awesome. Let's accept the offer. Three missiles, drone part, 23 sca scrap. Yeah, we'll take it. That's... Whew. We really lucked out there. Let's send everybody back to their stations. And then have fish come in here and fix up the FTL drive so we can get out of here. Actually, we can get out anyway. That was really tricky. Let's go in here. We're going to buy a power bar. And then just move on. We are running really low on fuel, too, which I don't like. Okay, well, we found a, a thing, another pirate. And they have, I think that's the Hermes missile, and they got three shoot. This, I am afraid this might be the end for us here. Let's power up this. Power down the med bay, power up the anti-ship. Okay. Everything's online, everything's operational. Let's do what we can to take these guys out. Just going to load up everything. Oh, whoops, full beam, no. Go this way, and then heavy laser there. Let's just hope that we can d uh, make some stuff happen here. Yes, that is that is perfect. Very good. Let's have the heavy laser go for the shields again. Whole beam stretch across here. Ion blast on the shield. It looks like we can take their shields down. That's definitely a possibility. Whole beam on the shield. It's uh, it's tricky, but... Oh, nope, not a whole beam there. Whole beam. 
Actually, hang on. We're going to do heavy laser on the shield, ion blast on the shield, and then we're not going to assign the whole beam just yet. We are going to wait until there is an opening for it. Oh, we're running, we're running low on health here. Okay, there's a fire. There's two fires. One in the door room. I don't like that. Let's send in these two to f work on that. Oh, man, this, this is getting difficult to manage. Okay, let's... Let's hope we can break through this. Their shields here soon, because if we can, then you know we can we can deal a lot of damage. But it's damn it, we keep missing with this heavy laser. Oh god! Oh, this thing's causing fires. I think. Maybe not. I, I, I'm only really seeing some of this stuff out of the corner of my eye. I don't know. Heavy laser on the shields. Okay, good. Alright, lay it across like this. Oh, perfect. That worked out really well. Let's put one power in the med bay so people can start getting healed. We'll have these two go fix the oxygen. Rockman come in here. And then we're going to just continue to whale on this guy. Their oxygen is down, so the crew should be busy. We'll start hitting their shields again while we wait for our whole beam to load up. Okay, actually heavy. We're gonna dump you over there. Good, perfect. A lot of their weapons are going offline. This is very good for us. Definitely very good. Uh, I thought I sent you to help fix the oxygen. Send you in there. Oh, damn it. Uh, this one actually should be pretty easy. We'll open up these doors, and that one should just go away on its own. Ion blast on the shield. And then whole laser across here, and that, I think, will do it. Yes. All right. That worked out. Whew. That worked out, but we are in not the greatest shape. We got 34th scrap and 3 fuel. But we are damaged pretty badly. Let's have these two come in here and help put out the fire. Good, perfect. We'll open up all the doors now. Oh wait, no we won't. Oxygen needs to turn, turn back on. Now we'll open up all the inside doors and let that oxygen spread through. Whew, that was, that was tough, but we are still alive. Let's have everybody go back to their stations. Those guys are. Charlie can go back over here. Almost in a good spot. Phillips back to the driver's seat. And we'll turn this back on. Okay, so we are still alive. We are in desperate need for a store, though. All right, let's see. We detect a destroyed cargo ship with its cargo scattered nearby intact. Now let's bring it aboard. Oh, God damn it. Another Mantis bomber, it was a trap. And we have two guys on board, three guys on board. Well, let's lock down the building. We'll send a Mantis in here. Damn it. Let's power this down, power down the med bay. Load this up. I don't wanna have to deal with this right now. Ah. Okay, Ion Blast on the shields. Whole beam, not gonna worry about that yet. Heavy laser also on shields. Oh wow, their boarding party is goddamn enormous. Who's left on their ship? Okay, um, damn. Their shields are down, but our whole beam isn't quite ready, so we're just gonna keep firing on their shields. And how are these guys doing? They're doing okay. They're holding their own whole beam. Good. Now let's go... Let's see. We need to stretch it across as many empty rooms as possible, which I think is... No. If we click here... Yeah, that should do good damage. How are things going on here? Not 
great, but not terrible. Did their shields come back on? They... Damn it. Alright, heavy laser on the shield, ion blast on the shield. How are my crew doing? Not terrible. Just gonna keep firing on their shields here. Oh, damn it, I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Missile got through. Not anything we can really do about that, but... Oh, and there's a breach. Okay, NG, we need you to fix that. How are these guys doing? Ohm's getting hurt pretty bad. Let's turn off oxygen for right now. We'll put it in here. Ah, damn it. I think this is the end for us, guys. I don't see us coming back from this. Okay, Ohm, you need to get out of there. You're dying. Everybody else, I think, is doing relatively okay. Oh, God damn it, now we have a fire. Okay, looks like their shields are down, so let's try to get through that as soon as possible. Okay, we are doing some damage to them. Not that it's, uh, that's much of a comfort considering the position we're in. Charlie looks like he's about to die. Let's put him over here so he can start putting out those fires. Our shields are damaged too. How did that happen? Oh, a missile probably hit it. Okay, it looks like their shields are offline right now. So let's try to hit their missiles. There we go. Oh, thank God. They're surrendering us. They're surrendering to us. We will gladly accept that offer. What? Are you kidding me? They had a missile in the air when they offered the surrender. Oh, that is underhanded, cheap bullshit game. We sur they surrendered to us. We won. Oh, but that is that's probably the best we've ever done. I'm uh, I'm impressed with how well we did there. That was uh that was a really good run. Definitely definitely a good one. Okay, well, thank you guys for watching. If you liked the video, consider giving it a thumbs up and subscribing. Uh, you can also follow me on Twitter at HollowedLeafLP. And uh, other than that, thanks for watching, guys. Thanks for hanging out with me, and I'll see you all next time.